Hey guys, welcome to your very own channel, Chronicles of Traders. This part of our channel is called as Tales of Common Trader. We have a special person on our channel who would be sharing his journey with us. So stay tuned. People always tend to think the business of trading and investing is only about money or all about numbers. We on our channel, Chronicles of Traders, would be proving this wrong. So the question is how we do it. We would be talking to people, people with right mindset, those people who have dreams, the ones who go beyond limits to fulfill their own and the dreams of the people associated to them. Today, we are going to talk to a person who went out of the way, went through many downfalls, but at last achieved it. He indeed is a close friend, the family man, a soul traveler, a person who is a IT professional and has traveled overseas in addition to being a stock trader. So let's welcome to our channel a dreamer, a stock market enthusiast, Ibrahim Atta. Hey Ibrahim, am I audible? Yeah, that's the question. Yeah, you're audible. And so uh, welcome to the channel. Uh, Ibrahim as I said, I have given you the introduction about him. But uh, I want Ibrahim to speak about himself and give us some insight about his life and uh, also about the trading. So, Ibrahim, please. Uh, thank you, Sudarshan, first of all, for providing this opportunity uh, to say something about uh, trading, which we discuss a lot, I guess, from past, I guess, for past one, one and a half years. Before. And yeah, uh, hello, friends. Uh, my name is Ibrahim Attar and I'm an IT professional. I uh, have 10 years of experience in IT. And Probably my primary source of income is uh, my job, my IT, what I do, right? And uh, yeah, trading, when you talk about, yeah, so something which I'm very excited about to talk, to learn. Uh, I'm not a professional trader, I'm, I'm just a normal retail trader, right? Who loves to take trade, who loves to see charts, and understand. Um, I mean, um, I'm doing this for, I guess, uh, three years, and it was. This, these things were introduced uh, from one of my friends. I mean, and that's how I developed my interest and started uh, learning more about this. And I, I think, yeah, this is something uh, I could invest my few hours in it, and I think I can make something out of it, right? So there's a lot of learning uh, uh, on this, uh, which I do on daily basis, uh, not, I mean, not very regularly. But yeah, of course, when I do get the opportunity, I, I do that. Uh, yep, so, talk uh, about this. Yep. Yep. So uh, basically, let's uh, let's start with some uh, a question which is in mind of different people. Uh, what do you think? Do you think that when we get tips, when we have a call from the Indore or when we call from Delhi, what do we need to do with those calls? What do you think? What do you think? Uh, of course, if you have a platform to register, you have a decent, a decent trade, ho, so they do get numbers, uh, your numbers, and you will get, I mean, you will get SMS, you will get SMS, and they'll try to uh, say that hey, we are offering multi bagger stock, we can give you 300% return, 400% return in a year, right? And they guarantee you to give that return. Uh, so, I mean, message per case, I mean, it seems very lucrative. They are, uh, 300% return. I mean, is it? I mean, you can see that 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 you that if someone is giving 300% return, so he'll message me, come on, invest in, in I'm, I'm giving you the step and you'll get 300% return. Either, if I'm going to invest in the mouse, then I'm invest in the mouse. What is the reason why I'm going to invest in the mouse? I'm going to invest in the mouse. So there are, I mean, uh, very uh, good examples uh, in last year, what we have seen for where people have lost a lot of money. Uh, and there's a big news about it, uh, which was circulated as well. Uh, Agro for 7R, 7NR, and uh, I guess there was one more name, right? Mario Dug, uh, yeah, right. So uh, these, yeah. So basically what I call uh, these kind of uh, things is, uh, what we call it, uh, it's pump and dump, right? Uh, they a message retail investors right to pump the money um, 
and some of the uh, scripts or some of the stocks and once that target is met they uh, you will see that the stock is keeping on i mean it's it's just falling and you can't exit it because there are no buyers against it and you have just have to wait till the point and every day that that stock will hit the lower limit lower limit lower limit and uh, at that at at some point of time that 150 rupees of stock will come to 5 rupees and you can't do anything about it you won't be able to sell it so uh, there are there are i mean there are various examples um, but yeah so don't trust on those things right um, no one can give you 300% of returns right there are mutual funds there are many big companies right uh, they provide so, I mean, so, so much things right and they just offer you 10 12 15% right there's a reason behind it right they do so much of uh, they do so much of homework then they they assure you to provide 15% 15% 20% not more than that right so it's so at seeing at first time of these thing 300% 200% 100% that's it's a thought for me uh, person right so uh, basically uh, as as we as we spoke about agrofos 7nr uh, uh, morya udyog these met- right. messages are uh, pretty much like uh, you can invest and get 300% but they are not charging right. it to you so that yeah, is yeah that is that is also a catch yeah yeah and this time who will who will give this things and that too for free i mean who has so much of time to invest in someone to call or message someone that too for free so so yeah that is complete fake and yeah, a few uh, days back I, uh, i shared one message that uh, i've got another message from the same kind of people i shared it on, on my whatsapp status please don't get to get into this <laughs> <laughs> right of course of course uh, yeah so uh, basically as you said uh, aap it sector se belong karte ho it has been 10 years you have spent in it sector uh, how do you manage the trading hours are in india are uh, it's like 9 to 5 uh, 9 to 3 and 9 to 5 for commodity so right. uh, how do you manage it so yeah right so i, I actually i don't do trading daily right uh, i'm i'm more i more like to do news based trading or uh, a swing trader trading or whenever i'm i'm, I'm i want to do when i have some time right uh, so i can't uh, clash both the things because uh, my job timing are pretty strict and i want to be there right so i i usually trade uh, in the first half only i mean my if, if i do a swing trading or something i'm pretty excited about or any trade or if any stocks which are which are on my watch list uh, so I, i i trade it around uh, the first half only right. till 12 I, i i only do intraday and that's all i mean i i don't uh, i'm not that experienced enough to invest that uh to do long term trading but i like to do uh, intraday and it's okay uh, I, if i if i even want to exit that trade with a loss i'm okay with that but uh, i usually don't carry up my trades yeah so as you said uh, exiting the uh, trade with a loss so right how about that do you always have yeah. a stop loss or you, there are there has been a uh, time where you had no stop loss and uh, you had your experience i think the biggest learning in the life uh, which i have paid uh, so much i mean you learn in school you learn in colleges right and you pay something for it i think the biggest learning which i have got from share market by paying that amount is always keep your stop loss and that stop loss should be in the application or i mean on your on your trading website on the trading portal and it should be it should not be in your brain it should not be in your mind it should be on that portal itself so yeah there are been days uh, in my early days when on when we group of friends we were doing this right two three years three years back and we all had a yeah a huge amount of loss uh, but it's okay i mean on those days we were pretty new to this and we were not aware Uh, how to enter this um, market and yeah market taught us that uh, that yeah how important stop loss is and yeah so stop loss is very very important every trade should have it if you are in intraday basically i'm not talking about the uh, long term trades because i have never taken any long term trades yet <laughs> So, yeah so you are not talking yeah, about intraday, the investments yeah. but although uh, yeah. about the intraday you should have stop loss 
Uh, one recommendation that I would also give is uh, for investments also, there should be a stop loss. See, every money that you put into uh, the market, it should always have something right. like if if you if you bought a stock of thousand rupees and it has went up to uh, one thousand thirty five, but it then came back to nine ninety five, and that is your risk. Right. Five rupees is your risk. Get out of that trade. Let it be investment. Correct. Let it be yeah. Or anything. It's just because correct. You still have ninety five percent of your money with you. Instead of losing right. everything, always yeah. sure that you have at least ninety to ninety five percent. With you, so that is Correct. how the stop loss should work. Uh, as you said, uh, you were new three years back, uh, three plus years, I can, I think. Uh, so, right. uh, what is your advice? Your advice? What will be for the new people? New people who the are new coming. People, right? Yeah. So, I mean, uh, I'm not sure what perspective you carry. Uh, any any new any new person carries when he wants to be market. Most of the people, I think, they like to invest the money, right? So, uh, be careful when investing the money. Uh, don't uh, invest in any other shares. Just the, if there are some, if someone is messaging you or offering a part three hundred, two hundred percent, right? So, don't invest in that. Uh, there are many good companies where you can invest in. Before investing, you can do your analysis as well. If you want to learn technical analysis, there are n number of videos in YouTube where you can learn the technical analysis, support and resistance, uh, trend lines. Maybe I guess that is the base of uh, any technical analysis, and there are n number of uh, indicators, uh, chart patterns, uh, and what what else? I mean, there's everything. What you can do. So for for investing, basically, but I personally uh, don't invest. Um, That I just traded. I put some capital, right? A small capital, ten uh, thousand or something, or more than that sometimes. And uh, I take a trade. Uh, I either I make a loss, I make a profit, or I make a loss, right? And there are there were days when I used to do in futures. Uh, there I had uh, a huge amount of loss because of not uh, maintaining the strict stop losses, right? But yeah, but now these days probably I, I like to uh, spend my time either in equity or in the options. That's all. I mean, I don't do any other thing else when I'm doing trading, or even even when I don't do trading, uh, I just keep on monitoring the uh, market uh, because trading helps me to keep updated with the news, what is going on. If I'm not trading, I remove all the uh, news apps or anything. I don't uh, from my phone. But once I'm involved in trading, I'll keep on adding everything what is required to keep me updated. So yes, so this is something that uh, I know about Ibrahim. I would like everyone to know. So what he does is, uh, whenever he is not trading, so he uninstalls all the apps from the mobile, so that uh, he is not uh, uh, going to this app and then opening up and doing something. He also removes all yeah. the uh, money from that, uh, all the funds from that. Uh, Correct. Yeah. Yeah. Demat account and he makes sure that he is not uh, going there. So it's it's one good thing, a way to handle your trades. It's it's his way to do it, uh, and I think it's a it's a good way to do it. So yes, uh, the most important question that I think uh, everyone is going to have: How much do you make? With trading, does it really help you uh, in your day-to-day -day, uh, lifestyle, or uh, has it made any difference? I'm asking this. The reason behind this is uh, you have a job, right? You already have a job, right? It's a good IT right. sector job. And uh, the other side, you are doing trading. Is is trading? Right. Is trading like you are going to be multi-millionaire soon? Is that kind of mindset? Uh, that see, we know that people carry that kind of mindset. Right. Right. So I want to uh, point to that mindset, and I want your experience to be shared with these people who have right. think that earning money in trading is like buy a hatka khele, I say. Right. Uh, and I want you to share the go wala thing. Uh, I think you what you mentioned about the mindset. Just like I told you, I mean, the whole thing is what is it? करना ही क्या है सिर्फ बाय करना है और सेल करना है इट्स इट्स व्हाट अ बिग डील राइट कोई भी कर सकता है 
एंड आई थिंक यहाँ कोई भी कर सकता है बट जहाँ हमको लगता है कि पैसे कमाना सबसे ज्यादा ईजी है वहीं सबसे ज्यादा मुश्किल होता है जहाँ हमको लगता है पैसे कमाना सबसे ज्यादा मुश्किल है वहीं सबसे ज्यादा ईजी होता है राइट सो टॉक अबाउट हाउ मच आई गेट फ्रॉम द ट्रेडिंग रियली नॉट not much right it's it's not that my bread and butter is trading and i do trading for my living no it's comp- it's not like that right um and i have a job uh, my bread and butter is that but yeah trading is something which helps me to get a uh, few things when i actually need it and it helps me to make some extra money when i need it but there are times i will be very clear with you but there are times when i have to put that money back to the uh, trading account when i end up with losses so it's one way and if i get frustrated i i i i take a rest for some days and i come back again uh, right uh, with a new start so yeah so i mean there's something which is keeping me uh, uh, i'm not i'm even after the losses i'm not able to leave this right because of my interest yes yeah, is sharing my experiences and discussing with my friends when i'm with them so uh, there's one good experience which i would like to share yeah the experience hai jo mere khayal se matlab aise bahut experiences hai bure din ke aur acche din ke but ye ek acche din ka experience hai jo i think i remember uh, mere ek friend tha wo bahut curious tha trading ke liye aur uh, we were in goa right so hum log jaise ki relax kar rahe the beach pe and i was just scrolling the apps so he just said ke and i was trading those days right so until uh, on i guess we were that day was thursday or something until wednesday i was trading i mean i was involved in trading uh, so uh, usne pucha ke bhai kya cheez hai aur main usko explain karne lag gaya aur that i mean wo explain karte karte hi ek matlab jo jis trade ko main carry forward kar raha tha jis trade ko main us week mein trade karta tha gsfc ek ka trade tha wo उसको मैं एक बार ट्रेड कर चुका था एंड आई लुक वो उसको बताते बताते आई फाउंड एन अपॉर्चुनिटी टू री ट्रेड अगेन राइट के इसको मैं ट्रेड कर सकता थोड़ी देर उसको एक्सप्लेन करने के आधा घंटा उसको मॉनिटर करने के बाद मॉर्निंग का टाइम था तो आई फाउंड एन अपॉर्चुनिटी यार एक बार ले लेते हैं इसको उसका फ्यूचर्स था आई मीन दिस इज बेस्ट वन टू ईयर्स बैक तो उसका फ्यूचर्स था मैंने जीएसएफसी का एक लॉट ले लिया था टाइम दैट लॉट वॉज अराउंड फोर्टी फाइव हंड्रेड का वो लॉट था and usko maine bataya ki yaar this is the price and we get at this price and we'll exit at this price and this will be our target agar meet hota to theek hai nahi hota to it's okay so target humne kuch 2 rupaye ka rakha tha theek hai but that target we were not able to reach it but usme kareeban kuch 90 paise ya 1 rupaye aa gaya tha that was around 4200 or something so i exited uh, at that time when i was i was seeing that green i exited right uh, that trade was done so that uh, that trade was i mean jab hum log discuss kar rahe the wo uh, bas wo discussion kuch 10 15 minute ka tha i, I guess aur jaise hi hamara discussion khatam hua uh, aur hum log kuch khane ke liye gaye i okay i have set it the stop loss and uh, i have sorry, set it my stop loss and uh, if that is going to be green hum log usko exit kar denge kind of तो वो हम लोग मतलब थोड़ी देर के पांच से दस मिनट के बाद आए एंड दैट ट्रेड वाज एग्जीक्यूटेड सक्सेसफुली विद फोर्टी टू हंड्रेड प्रॉफिट एंड या सो उसके लिए उसका मतलब उस उसका नजरिया ऐसा था कि यार दिस इज सो इजी एंड दिस इज सो फैसिनेटिंग राइट अभी हम बात ही कर रहे थे दस मिनट पहले और यू बुक अराउंड फोर्टी टू हंड्रेड और मतलब मैंने भी जब पहली बार किसी का देखा था तो मेरे ख्याल से ऐसे था तो मतलब मेरा उसको ये एडवाइस था कि ये बहुत ही छोटे दिन होते हैं और बहुत अच्छे दिन जो होते हैं बहुत कम होते हैं लेकिन जो जिस वॉट वी कॉल एज रेड डेज राइट वेर वी हैव लॉसेस तो ऐसे बहुत ज्यादा दिन होते हैं राइट और ऐसे बहुत सारे लॉसेस वाले दिन हम देख चुके हैं बट या होंगे इनका स्टॉप लॉस ये उनको टेलीग्राम चैनल पे या किसी व्हाट्सएप चैनल पे Uh, the guys who are earning money, they are getting dependent on this YouTube channels, or uh, they are right. getting dependent on uh, other people to give them tips. Okay. Correct. अगर एक दिन इस बंदे का दिमाग घूम गया, उसने बोला आज मैं गलत टिप दे, इसका जितने लोगों का नुकसान हो तो हो, मुझे कोई सिर्फ just in a 
just in a sense correct so these correct. you are so much dependent on these people that you get profits but when you get losses you see right. them, you blame them right right ki yaar isne mujhe bataya tha aisa hua fir uske wajah se aisa hua ye correct lekin trading ko as a business nahi sochte abhi abhi tak nahi sochte india mein to nahi sochte india mein aisa hai ki bhed chal hai एक बंदे को अगर लोगों को लग रहा है कि रिलायंस ऊपर जाएगा तो सब रिलायंस के पीछे पड़ जाते बट दे आर दे आर नॉट लुकिंग एट दी अदर टू थाउजेंड प्लस शेयर और स्टॉक्स विच आर ऑलरेडी प्रेजेंट एंड दे आर ऑल्सो गोइंग अप ठीक है अभी का एग्जांपल है आई शेयर दिस एग्जांपल विद यू इट वॉज अबाउट आलोक इंडस्ट्रीज आलोक इंडस्ट्री आलोक इंडस्ट्रीज में इसने रिलायंस ने पैसा लगाया रिलायंस ने पैसा लगाया तो लोगों ने आलोक इंडस्ट्री बाय करना शुरू किया और उसका अपर सर्किट लगता हुआ चला गया मैंने खुद मेरे इंस्टाग्राम पे डाला था कि आलोक इंडस्ट्री बॉड बाय रिलायंस इंडस्ट्रीज एंड दी आलोक इंडस्ट्री स्टॉक इज हिटिंग अपर सर्किट दैट इज वॉट आई पोस्टेड देर तो आई नेवर सेट दैट गो एंड बाय आई नो एक बार जो कंपनी बंद पड़ चुकी है तो उसका क्या भरोसा हो दूसरी बार बंद नहीं पड़े और थोड़े दिन से उसमें लोअर सर्किट लगना शुरू हो चुका है वापस न्यूज़ बेस्ड मार्केट सो बेसिकली न्यूज बेस्ड मार्केट में ट्रेडिंग करना अच्छी बात है इट्स ओके यू कैन डू इट बट इट्स जस्ट डोंट हैव टू बी डिपेंडेंट ऑन दीज यूट्यूब चैनल टू गिव यू दैट इन्फॉर्मेशन करेक्ट आई थिंक दैट आई आई पॉजिटिव थॉट वेन He created this uh, YouTube channel is getting people like you and telling everyone around us is not about it's not about uh, being dependent on someone. खुद का दिमाग चला, खुद का कुछ create करो. Because trading में अगर हम दस साल लगा देते हैं, जैसे आप इब्राहिम का example लेते हैं, आपका example लेते हैं. So you, what you have done is you have put in so so many years of experience in there, and now you are seeing that okay, जब trade लेने बैठते हैं तो उसके पहले हम स्टॉप लॉस के बारे में सोचते हैं सबसे पहले हम स्टॉप लॉस के बारे में सोचते हैं कि ये मेरा स्टॉप लॉस है ये मेरा रिस्क है उसके आगे फिर बाद में जाके हम सोचते हैं कि ठीक है ये मेरा टारगेट है यहाँ पे लोगों का उल्टा है लोग सोचते हैं कि एक्सपेक्टेशन ये है अपने वो दस लाख रुपए कमाने इस महीने में सो ये तो सारी चीजें है दिस इज वॉट वी आर ट्राइंग टू एज इन पॉइंट आउट की दिस इज नॉट हाउ योर माइंड सेट शुड बी You gave a good example about Goa. तो जो Goa का example था वो तो मुझे बहुत सही लगता है मैं हमेशा जब सुनता हूँ Goa का example तो मुझे लगता है कि this is so relatable कि लोगों या मैं इतना easy है वो but I mean it मतलब मेरे हिसाब से मैं उसको ऐसा लेता हूँ कि I I guess uh, that was uh, apart from my understanding of that particular stock uh, at that particular time it some something went right or correct at that particular moment so it went on my way. अदरवाइज इफ इट कुड बी अटॉप लॉ सेट तो उसके लिए गलत उसके लिए एग्जाम्पल शायद कुछ और हो जाता कहानी उसके लिए कुछ और हो जाती है शायद वो उसका जो एक्सपीरियंस है ट्रेडिंग के लिए अभी वो फैसन मतलब वो एक्साइटेड रहता है ट्रेडिंग के बारे में बात करने के लिए उसको लगता है यार कि मिनटों में पैसे कमा सकते हैं यहाँ से लेकिन शायद उसने अगर वो किसी मेरे अलावा या या शायद मेरे साथ ही कोई वही ट्रेड को नेगेटिव में जाता है और देख लेता तो उसके दिमाग में माइंड सेट बैठ जाता है अगर फर्स्ट एग्जाम्पल या फर्स्ट इंसिडेंट उसके रहता हो जाता तो उसके दिमाग में शायद बैठ जाता कि मे बी यार एक ही मिनट में या पांच ही मिनट में ही लॉस फाइव थाउजेंड और समथिंग लाइक दैट सो इट कुड बी वे बट आई थिंक जितना ज्यादा फास्ट आप लॉस करते हो उतना फास्ट आप अर्निंग भी कर सकते हो मैं ऐसा सोचता हूँ तो इट डजेंट मैटर इफ आई लॉस फ्यू लैक्स आई ऑलरेडी डेड इट बट आई आई नो दैट आई वुड बी एबल टू मेक अप दैट सून एंड आई एम शार्ट इट रिकवरिंग दैट सो इट्स गुड I'm confident enough to recover that. Coming to that, uh, coming to that statement that you have started recovering uh, what you are lost in uh, the experience or gaining the experience. Tell us about the last trade that you had and which was a winning. Right. Obviously, I know because we share it. So tell us Correct, uh, right. about that winning trade. Yeah, I mean, uh, I mean, due to this COVID situation, I know. I mean, uh, the, the sector which is. more in news these days is pharma sector right and uh, we already seen uh, seen what happened with glenmark apan samne dekha hai ki glenmark glenmark was according to me it's a pump and dump uh ek hi din mein wo 100 rupaye badh gaya and the same moment i guess next day it was again back to its yeah. original uh, point where it went it 
so uh, there are there were few companies which are i was also monitoring biocon was one of them uh, biocon is a good company uh, so when i look at the chart uh, and when i look at that script uska koi 520 ka hai tha and uh, the the stock was trading around 510 or 511 at that time 510 511 so i was expecting on that day uh, that was on thursday friday i believe i was expecting it should reach again towards it high because of the news they were they were news two three days days back so it's kind of news like they were uh, launching some uh, medicine and it was subject to uh, the drug association approvals kind of that so who is in the uh, nia and the stock stuck around 413 or something on that day i had got an option for that and i was like see option liya tha uh, or uh, I mean Friday I hold that C option. I mean exit me kya tha? It was around my buying price. Thoda sa hi loss tha usme kuch 500 hazar rupee ka. So I decided to hold it and let's see what happens on Monday. Saturday a news flash is that yeah Biocon got that DGCA approval and uh, uh, so I was I was pretty excited. I know that kuch to hoga isme ya to I mean agar ye news based hai to isme over buying ho chuki thi but kyunki usne upper circuit बहुत पास था वो और वो हिट नहीं हुआ था तो आई थिंक देर इज एन अपॉर्चुनिटी कि यार ये कुछ तो देखे जाएगा अब इसको लिया ही है तो भले इसको अगर अपन थोड़े प्राइस में काट देंगे तो भी दैट इज फाइन आई मीन दैट ट्रेड शुड बी एग्जिट लेकिन जैसी ये ऑप्शन था और ये बहुत वॉलेटाइल होता है पहले स्टार्टिंग के पंद्रह मिनट के अंदर सो अगर ये प्री ओपन इसका बहुत हाई होता है प्री ओपनिंग फाइव इज एक्सपेक्टिंग इसकी प्री ओपनिंग चार के आसपास हो जाए चार सौ से तो उसकी प्री ओपनिंग हुई अराउंड 437, 438. I'm not sure with the exact uh, number. लेकिन वो अबाउ फोर थर्टी फाइव उसकी प्री ओपनिंग हुई उसको ऑप्शन का प्राइस uh, मेरा कुछ बाइंग था उसका ऑप्शन का 14 का एंड uh, वो उसको ऑप्शन उप, की प्री ओपनिंग हुई प्रीमियम जो मेरे पास 14 का प्रीमियम था और उसका जो ऑप्शन की प्री ओपनिंग हुई दैट वॉज ऑन ट्वेंटी टू एंड आई वॉज लुकिंग ऑन दैट फॉर अ मिनट it's it it went to 22.95 or 23 or uske baad it it went on falling because the stock uh, the stock price was falling down and i realized that so i decided to cut it on 20 when it was on 21 i decided because agar mai 21 lagata utni der mein uska uh, premium already decrease ho jata i won't be getting a buyer there so i decided to cut it on 20 and there was a buyer there on 20 and i decided to quit so yeah i think that, that was a pretty decent trade i did last week uh, and i was able to book around 16500 of that and uh, yeah so, so basically basically if i see uh, it's not completely news based trading what you right. saw is there are different uh, scenarios to this so right. one thing is you saw that ye jo uh, stock hai wo uske upper limit ke paas hai sabse pehle it's going to be there so you have you have analyzed the chart first then what you did okay. is aap uh, uh, news pe gaye news pe dekha ki okay ye news aayi hai okay ye right. news aayi hai to aapne verify kiya ki news aur saturday ko aap verify it mila ki okay this is this has been confirmed uske baad right. jab confirm ho jata hai india mein news to hame pata hai kya hota hai hamesha stock upar jata hai right. aur sellers usko sell kar dete hai aur sell karne ke baad right. aap niche aa jata hai to we right. know so right. you just followed a strategy that you have been building for so many years so it it comes with an experience it, it is not like it's so agar so i don't interrupt but agar maine i mean agar maine isko pura news based liya hota to i what i would have done it maine uh, saturday ka news padh ke isko monday liya rehta around 435 yes. Yes. and the point I, where i have invested is wo 415 aa jata same day and then i would either have to cut uh, on the stop loss or option is completely dependent or directly proportional to the time value time right that's so, right. pretty important so i have only uh, two more questions for you what is your take on current ma- market situation uh, current market situation we have seen that market has hit uh, 
the low low of 7500 or close to 7500 right and now it started recovering and we are on 10900 maybe yesterday we hit around 10900 right i'm not sure i mean i read uh, many blogs or analysts what they say what they say on news so i just take from them because they are uh, they they provide more valuable suggestion they do a lot of analysis uh, and why but certainly i feel that uh, the bears are still there to hold the market down and my and i mean i will not say my observation or anything on that because i'm no one to say that but uh, just if if i if i if i say my perspective is so i i personally feel that the the, the bears are still there and uh, we could see some downside from the current point which is 10900 right so i mean soon or later probably uh, ending this uh, we could see the bottom 500 or something like that. Yep. So, yes. So, uh, I think everyone should be uh, very cautious uh, when we uh, enter into the market now because it's a volatile market that right. we understand from this. Yeah. Let's take an example of uh, last Friday. So, it went up to uh, it went up to 10,700 or something like that and after less, i think it went le, uh, below 10700 and after that there was a bullish run which took it to 10900 so yes yeah. it's a pretty volatile market and every, everyone should be very uh, they should be very aware of this that if they put in money it should, it, uh, it would be completely based on analysis so always look for some good analysis or at least try to build your own knowledge on that uh okay so before ending this interview one thing that uh, you would like to share on a personal front uh, about trading and what what do your what are your takes on trading going on for the new people because see this 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 channel is for new people so we have earned from the community it's time to give back to the community let me talk on ground level itself right so मतलब मेरी यही एडवाइस है यार कि आप कोई भी ट्रेड ले रहे हो ना इट डजेंट मैटर आप किसी से आपको किसी से टिप्स से ले रहे हो या आप कहीं से भी ले रहे हो आपको कहीं से टिप मिल रही है यू पे आई मीन बहुत सारे चैनल्स हैं जो टेलीग्राम पे आपको थोड़े पैसे दे के आपको कुछ सम आर रियली गुड एज वेल आपको रिसेंट दे भी देंगे एंड यू कैन सी आई मीन इफ यू आर एबल बट प्रॉब्लम इज दैट यू हैव टू टाइम इट वहाँ पर आपको टाइम करना होता है वहाँ पर अगर आप टाइम नहीं कर पाए तो उसने आपको एक मतलब फॉर एग्जांपल एक एग्जांपल दे रहा हूँ छोटा सा वो आपको एक देगा रिलायंस का एक शेयर प्राइस अभी 1100 उसने बोला आपको 1100 के ऊपर एंटर कर लो टारगेट ले लो 1110 और स्टॉप लॉस लगा लो 995 का ठीक है तो अगर उसने 1110 का टारगेट लिया तो यू डोंट हैव टू वेट टिल ग्यारह राइट यू हैव टू बी क्विक एंड नॉट टू अंडरस्टैंड की मेरे को मेरा ट्रेड कहाँ कट करना है राइट right? uh, और uh, जहाँ पे आप आपके स्टॉप लॉस को चेंज कर सकते हो वी कॉल एज मतलब स्टॉप लॉस को ट्रेल करना है काइंड ऑफ उसको थोड़ा हाइड लाइक जो बोल रहे हो तो वो आपको ध्यान रखना है आप मतलब और मेन ऑब्जेक्टिव आपका एट द एंड ऑफ द डे आप स्टार्ट कहीं से भी करो डजेंट मैटर आपको थोड़ा सा लॉस भी हो जाएगा कई दिनों में इट्स फाइन बट कीप ऑन लर्निंग अगर मतलब आप जब तक आप सीखोगे नहीं तब तक आप एक्चुअली इससे ऑन नहीं कर सकते मतलब मैं भी अभी तक इससे बहुत ज़्यादा ऑन नहीं कर रहा हूँ ये मैंने भी बहुत ज्यादा सीखा नहीं है आई एम जस्ट अ नॉर्मल पर्सन लाइक यू राइट आई ट्राई टू लर्न एवरी डे एंड बट आई फील एट सम पॉइंट ऑफ टाइम माय लाइफ आई वुड बी अंडरस्टैंडिंग कांसेप्ट एट अ गुड लेवल एंड आई कुड मेक अ गुड अमाउंट ऑफ मनी फ्रॉम इट बट इट्स जस्ट माय थिंकिंग आई एम नॉट श्योर आई माइट बी गो रॉन्ग एज वेल राइट सो बट इट्स जस्ट माय थैंक यू और दूसरी चीज के अपने डेट को अपनी ईगो पे मत लो यार कोई दिक्कत नहीं है अगर आपका ट्रेड गलत गया आप ट्रेड एग्जिट करो खत्म करो आप तो कोई बात नहीं ठीक है क्या फर्क पड़ जाएगा अपने ट्रेड को ईगो पे लेके आप चले जाओगे हमने कई ट्रेड अपने ईगो पे लिए स्टार्टिंग में जब हम नए थे इसमें मतलब मेरे दोस्तों के साथ हमने स्टार्ट किया था बहुत सारे में भी वो नेक्स्ट कभी चैनल पे आपके साथ आ जाएंगे एंड तब तो वो शेयर करेंगे तो हमने काफ़ी ज़्यादा अच्छा लॉस लिया है सिर्फ ट्रेड अपने ईगो पे लेके या अपने फ्रेंड्स के साथ के नहीं यार हम इसको होल्ड ही करेंगे इसको होल्ड ही करेंगे पड़ेगा ये सो डोंट डू लाइक दैट जस्ट कट इट एंड जस्ट लीव इट खत्म करो कोई प्रॉब्लम हम लोग आज नहीं करते ऐसा ये कट इट एंड लीव इट यू नो दैट कि ये गलत है और ये ये डिफरेंस होता है एक्चुअली प्रोफेशनल ट्रेडर में और एक रिटेल ट्रेडर में मेरे ख्याल से जो रिटेल ट्रेडर्स हैं जैसे हम जैसे हैं हम लोग प्रोफेशनल 
और हम लोग यही गलती करते छोटी छोटी स्टॉप लॉस नहीं लगाना ओवर ट्रेड करना ओवर ट्रेड मत करो मैं अगर मतलब अगर मैंने डिसाइड कर लिया कि आज मैंने ट्रेड लिया एंड इफ आई अर्न टू थाउजेंड रुपीज आई जस्ट साइन आउट या एप्लीकेशन आई टू आउट एंड डू सम अदर वर्क और रादर मैं अगर बहुत फर्स्ट ट्रेड हूँ तो मैं ऐप डिलीट कर देता हूँ जब कल वापस आऊंगा तो कल वापस से ऐप इंस्टॉल करके वापस से लॉग इन कर लूंगा कोई बड़ी बात नहीं बट आई डोंट वॉन्ट टू लुक एट दिस ट्रेड मतलब मेरा तो मानना है कि अगर आपने ट्रेड ले लिया है अगर आपने चार पाँच हजार रुपये कमा लिए तो आपको वहाँ रुकने की जरूरत ही नहीं है अगर आप रुके तो आई कैन अश्योर यू कि आप लोग अगर आपने रुका और आपने पैसे ट्रेड लिया वो ट्रेड आपको लॉस में जाएगा और आपने चार हजार कमाया पाँच हजार देखे जाऊंगे मेरे साथ ऐसा कई बार हो चुका है मेरे साथ कई बार हो चुका है ओवर ट्रेड मैंने जब भी किया है तब भी मैंने लॉस किया है तो आई लर्न दैट एज वेल कि भाई ओवर ट्रेड नहीं कर रहे हैं ओवर ट्रेड हो गया आपका ट्रेड हो गया सक्सेसफुल हो गया ठीक है कोई बात नहीं अमाउंट लो चुप पर चले जाओ मार्केट से दूर कुछ दिन के लिए लॉस हो गया है तो भी ओवर ट्रेड करने की जरूरत नहीं कोई बात नहीं एग्जिट करो छोड़ दो चले जाओ एक दो ट्रेड मतलब मैं तो एक ही ले पाता हूँ जनरली मेरे ऑफिस टाइम या इसकी वजह से बट हाँ ठीक है मतलब आई डोंट टेक इट ठीक है कोई बात नहीं होते रहता फाइन ओनली इन्वेस्ट द मनी विच यू हैव इट सेफ जिस पैसे का आपको काम नहीं है ट्रेडिंग में उसी पैसे से आओ डोंट टेक लोन या ऐसा कुछ करके कि आपको डबल ही हो जाएंगे कभी नहीं होंगे पूरे चले जाएंगे मतलब आई कैन श्योर यू दैट अगर आप नॉर्मल से ऐसे ही कोई वीडियोस देख के आ रहे हो कि यार नहीं ठीक है बहुत सिंपल है देख लेते ट्राई कर लेते सब अप स्टॉक फ्री में ट्रेडिंग अकाउंट खोल देता है जीरो का फ्री में ट्रेडिंग अकाउंट खोलता है डोट डू डू लाइक दैट राइट लर्न इट देर आर ए नंबर ऑफ चैनल्स कुछ अच्छे कुछ पेड चैनल्स भी है जहाँ से आपको सीखना है बेसिक सब सीख लो धीरे धीरे फिर आप बाकी भी चीज़ सीखोगे आप ट्रेडिंग व्यू बहुत अच्छा है एप्लीकेशन में चार यूज और जो और चार्ट आना है चार्ट पैटर्न आना है चार्टिंग वहाँ पे बहुत लोग भी ऑब्जर्वेशन भी डालते हैं विद इन टर्म्स ऑफ चार्ट्स दे पेज चार्ट्स और फिर उनके एनालिसिस बताते हैं वो आई 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 रियल यूज दैट वेरी नॉट आई यूज टॉक एच और फिर बहुत सारे ऐप्स है Do take care of your money. Saving capital is more important than winning or losing, right? मतलब ऐसा नहीं मानते कि आप दस साल एक दिन में लेके आ रहे हो और एक दिन में जीरो करके जा रहे हो। ऐसा होता है। Believe me, if you are in future, जो शायद ये मेरी बात वो लोग समझ रहे होंगे, जो ये future का option है, शायद किसी ने अगर trade किया होगा तो intraday के लिए specifically, तो एक दिन में zero भी हो जाता है, कोई बड़ी बात नहीं है। उससे � Preserve your stop loss in the portal or in your mind, and uh, don't do ghostic trading. That's it from my side. I think Sudarshan, thanks a lot for providing this opportunity uh, for a normal retail trader uh, like me <laughs> to speak on this. Platform. See, thank you so much. It's not about being a normal retail trader, but it's it's about being a trader and being a professional in the IT sector, doing both the things hand in hand. So, ये जो चीज है ना ये बहुत कम लोग कर पाते लोग सोचते हैं कि मैं जॉब छोड़ देता हूँ और फिर मैं ट्रेडिंग करूंगा और मैं बहुत पैसा कमाऊंगा जो बात हमने भी सोचा था एक टाइम पे <laughs> जब हम बात लगा था कि तो हम बहुत सारा पैसा कमा सकते हैं <laughs> जो जो बात तुमने अभी ये कुछ शब्दों में बताई है ना दैट इज वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट एंड दिस लर्निंग एक्सपीरियंस a professional right, right. is going to repeat it many times but when right. subscribers that we have yes we have 60 70 sub- 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 subscribers now but right. and they will hear it from a common retailer i say common not a normal one you have learned it so you are not normal now you are a common retailer and when they hear it from you they would be like yes ye sachai hai ये अपना एक भाई बता रहा है तो इसका सुनना बहुत इंपॉर्टेंट है सो दिस इज दिस इज वॉट आर चैनल राइट सो बिफोर यू लीव बिफोर वी बिफोर वी स्टॉप द इंटरव्यू आई वॉन्ट यू टू से लाइक शेयर एंड सब्सक्राइब क्रॉनिकल्स ऑफ ट्रेडर्स या गाइज प्लीज डू लाइक डू शेयर डू सब्सक्राइब सपोर्ट सुदर्शन He will give you a lot of learnings about trading tips. He has excellent knowledge about uh, chart analysis, trend lines, support resistance. And he'll bring a lot of value to this channel to the subscribers. So do that. I've already done it from my side, and I'll keep on sharing and recommending to other ones as well. Thank you.
Thank you, Ibrahim. So, guys, uh, we would end this interview here itself. Uh, although before we end it, uh, I would like to say this is an initiative, and this should uh, go on. It's not about uh, just earning from trading or learning different uh, things from about trading. It's about the mindset that we are trying to tackle here. And therefore, we are interviewing all these individuals, individuals who have their experience with them, and they are sharing with us. So thank you for joining us today like share and subscribe chronicles of traders